dear students welcome to one more new video of social science in this video let us see sslc social science model question paper with key answers first main the first state to be formed based on language in india mysore state andhra pradesh saurashtra uttar pradesh correct answer option b andhra pradesh the immediate cause for the first world war was formation of triple entente and triple alliances america followed neutral policy humiliating treaty of versailles assassination of archduke francis ferdinand option d assassination of archduke francis ferdinand is the correct answer article 21 a of our constitution refers fundamental rights to religion fundamental right against exploitation fundamental right to constitutional remedies fundamental right to education option d fundamental right to education is the correct answer the best example for unpaid work bonded labor agricultural labor housewife gardener housewife option c is the correct answer the best example for conventional source of energy wind energy natural gas solar energy hydroelectric power option b natural gas the tea port of india Mang new mangalore haldia paradeep kolkata option d kolkata is the correct answer district industrial centers were established in the year 1968 1978 1988 1998 option b 1978 the father of green revolution in india dr norman borlaug kiran mazumdar shah dr m s swaminathan vargis kurian option c dr m s swaminathan second main answer the following questions in a sentence each why is sardar vallabhbhai patel called iron man of india he was successful in bringing integration of provinces what is the importance of teen murti bhavan the efforts of the mysore jodhpur and hyderabad lances were immortalized by erecting war memorial at new delhi as teen murti bhavan which country is supporting indian claim for permanent seat in the security council of uno russia why was prohibition of prenatal gender determination test act passed in order to stop sex determination tests of fetuses through modern technology what is dowry any kind of property jewelry or gift given to the bridegroom at the time of marriage either before or after the marriage is called dowry why should we grow mangrove forest along the coast to prevent coastal erosion what do you mean by budget the statement of estimated income and expenditure of a country prepared by the government maruti has planned to go on for a foreign trip during his absence to keep secure all his jewelries which services can he avail from the bank safe deposit lockers third main name the prominent organizations that brought social and religious reform movements in 19th century brahma samaj arya samaj prarthana samaj satyashodhak samaj aligarh movement ramakrishna mission theosophical society what were the effects of the first war of indian independence the governance of east india company came to an end the governance of british government started the administration of india was handed over to secretary of indian affairs the queen of britain passed a declaration the agreements entered by the company were accepted non perseverance of regional expansion providing a stable government for indians equality before the law non interference of the government in religious issues of indians and practicing religious tolerance list out the measures taken to solve the problem of regionalism the constitution emphasizes national unity and integrity single national citizenship provided the federal structure the preamble of our constitution declares we the people of india launched many projects for the development of the north 
North East states committees have been formed to achieve regional balance. List out the measures taken to control terrorism. India's policy is totally against terrorism of all kinds in and around our nation. Our central government as well as state governments are continuously venturing to control terrorism and thereby protect men and property. Anti-terrorist forces are set up especially trained to combat terrorism. Many a time our defense forces are pressed into action to throw out terrorism. India has even assisted the neighbor countries like Sri Lanka to restrain terrorist activities as a peace-loving nation India is against terrorism, which are the legal measures to eradicate untouchability in India. Section 17 of the constitution prohibits the practice of untouchability. The Untouchability Crime Act was implemented in 1955. Some locani of this act were rectified and the act was amended as Citizens Rights Protection Act in 1976. According to this act, practice of untouchability is a punishable offence. Besides, universal suffrage and right to equality have been guaranteed in the constitution to all citizens of the country. All people belonging to backward caste, especially DSC, have been provided reservation in educational, political, economic and unemployment opportunities. The regulation of 1989 confers special responsibilities to the state governments with regard to eradication of untouchability. In this manner, independent India have been striving to provide equal opportunities to all citizens by showing great interest in curbing the evil practice of untouchability. Or which programs enable rural women to get suitable representation in developmental programs? Women self-help groups empowering the women socially, empower the women financially, encouraging women to participate actively in these groups, microfinance helped women to lead an independent life, to face the atrocities heaped on them effectively, to get their fundamental human rights independently, opportunities to participate in all developmental programs, representation in developmental projects. Name the climatic seasons along with their months in India. Summer season March to May, Southwest monsoon season June to September, retreating monsoon season October to November, winter season December to February. How is national power reducible? India generates power from various sources. All the states do not have sufficient electric power supply at all times. Hence to supply power from surplus states to deficit states in national power grid is established. With its help, excess power from any state can be supplied to any other power deficit state. Name the housing programs taken up in India. Indira Avas Yojana, Ambedkar Valmiki Housing Program. Ashray Yojana. What are the main objectives of Consumer Protection Act? The Act accords importance for safety and quality, avoiding production and sale of dangerous goods, prevention of trail mal trade malpractices in the market, supervision on quality weights, measures and price, compensating the consumers in case of any problem arising as a result of trade, creating awareness to the consumers through consumer education. Fourth main, explain how Raja Martanda Varma made his kingdom strong and great. He saved his kingdom from the surrounding rulers as well as foreigners. He made Vainad as a great kingdom among all. He stood against the foreigners who were greedy of pepper. He brought many reforms in administration. He shifted his capital from Padmanabhapura to Tiruvananthapura. He made his kingdom as World Travancore Province or explain how Wellesley brought Indian kings under their control. The Indian kings had to keep the British army in their kingdom. The state concerned had to bear the expenses of the army and the wages of soldiers. The king had to have a British resident in his court. The king could not appoint any other European. 
in order to enter into any agreement or pact with any indian state the permission of the governor general was mandatory the company would offer protection to the state from any internal or external aggression what were the achievements of krishna raj wadiyar fourth he was very much interested in spreading education among his people he abolished fee in all primary schools to develop primary education he helped girls education he started the university of mysore the indian institute of science was established special attention was given to the development of irrigation a barrage was constructed across kaveri near belagola new railway lines were laid the iron and steel factory cement factory paper mills at padravati sugar factory at mandya sandal oil factory at mysore soap factory at mangalore chemical and fertilizers factory at belagola were started legislative council was formed he had a lot of interest towards fine arts and encouraged musicians mysore became a model state due to his administration partition of india was inevitable at the time of independence justified throughout the freedom struggle the congress supported a united india the muslim league on the other hand kept on demanding a nation for muslims jinnah declared that hindus and muslims could never form a country the labor party sent a cabinet mission to have talks with india about self rule a difference of opinion arose between the congress and muslim league with reference to formation of interim government the muslim league gave a call to observe direct action day due to this widespread communal riots took place throughout the country the muslim league did not participate in the constituent assembly the british government declaring that it would transfer power soon sent lord mount patton as viceroy to india mount patton had talks with gandhi ji jinnah and others and framed a plan to divide india on 15th august 1947 two nations named india and pakistan came into existence what are the aims and objectives of uno to maintain international peace and security to develop friendly relations among nations to establish faith in fundamental human rights to achieve international cooperation in solving international problems to establish justice and respect for international obligation to function as a center for harmonizing the actions of nations how has the government planned to tackle the problem of unemployment population control encouragement to cottage industries agricultural development industrial development educational reforms five year plans encouragement to vocational education rural development employment guarantee programs information technology write about the frontiers and neighboring countries of india the frontiers india being a peninsula it has both land and water frontiers too india has 15200 kilometers of land frontiers sand 6100 kilometers of coastline neighboring countries india shares land frontiers with seven nations in the northwest it shares with afghanistan and pakistan in the north with china nepal and bhutan in the east with myanmar and bangladesh sri lanka in the south maldives in the southwest why it is necessary to protect forests in india expansion of agriculture animal grazing construction of roads and railway routes irrigation projects forest fires mining or the cropping patterns differs from area to area in india why land forms climate soil water availability economic factors social factors technology what measures were taken to enable decentralization to enable decentralization the panchayat raj system has been brought into practice the indian government in 1993 through the 73rd amendment to the constitution brought into existence a uniform system of panchayat raj institution throughout the country due to this the panchayat institutions got constitutional status as per the amendment three tier system of panchayat came into existence they were gram panchayat taluk panchayat and zilla panchayat panchayat institution operate according to principles of 
democracy or what measures were taken to bring green revolution growing crops using high yielding grains providing specific nutrients regulated supply of water protection from diseases the use of chemical fertilizers and pesticides agri markets were improved surplus produce had to be processed granaries and gold sto- cold storage warehouses to store the surplus produce the latest technology government subsidized the fertilizers and equipments what are the functions of banks accepting deposits from public and others lending money to public and other institutions transferring money from one place to another collecting money by check draft bills discounting of bills hiring safe deposit lockers conducting foreign exchange transactions keeping valuables in safe custody issuing letter of credit and guarantee conducting government transaction or what are the characteristics of an entrepreneur creativity innovation dynamism leadership team building achievement motivation problem solving goal orientation risk taking decision making commitment fifth one question number 34 explain the struggle between the french and the english for their supremacy in south india the first carnatic war on the request of duplex labodina invaded madras and captured it from the english this forced the helpless british to request the help of anuruddin the nawab of carnatic the army sent by anuruddin failed to defeat the french at madras finally labodinas took money from the english and returned madras and went back to mauritius this enraged duplex and he attempted to take madras but failed finally the war ended with treaty of axla chapel second carnatic war in the carnatic chanda sahib had become the nawab with the help of british robert clive of east india company attacked our court the capital city of carnatic and defeated chanda sahib chanda sahib was imprisoned and later killed in the war in the place of chanda sahib the english named mohammad ali the son of anuruddin as the nawab of carnatic the second carnatic war ended with the treaty of pondicherry the french recalled duplex the third carnatic war county lali of the french attempted to besiege the fort wandivash in this decisive battle sir aircoot of the english army defeated the french and imprisoned bussi lali escaped and hid in pondicherry finally aircoot attacked pondicherry and lali had to surrender unconditionally what were the impacts of british education system in india modernity secularism democratic attitudes and rationality impetus was received for the local literature and languages periodical started emerging new social and religious reformation movements emerged j s mill rousseau montesquieu the freedom struggle that were taking place across the globe influenced the indians also indians could understand and appreciate their rich tradition what were the impacts of land tax system by british in india a new class of zamindars was created the farmers who were subjected to the exploitation of the zamindars land became a commodity loans could be raised by mortgaging the lands many zamindars also had to mortgage their lands the agriculture sector became commercialized the money lenders became strong what measures are taken to improve the status of women in india women and children development department health education and social status of women are improved women education prohibition of child marriage act dowry prohibition act stri shakti program loan and subsidy for women self employment mahila mandalas yuvati mandalas stri shakti organization commission at national and state level have been constituted the reservation for women from panchayat to parliament in karnataka already 33% reservation has been implemented in government jobs women reservation has been provided how is black soil different from laterite soil black soil the soil the black soil is formed from the weathering of igneous rock laterite soil is found normally in the areas receiving more than 200 cm of rainfall it contains more of clay particles and black in color this soil looks red in color 
इट इज मोर फर्टाइल इट इज लेस फर्टाइल महाराष्ट्र गुजरात मध्य प्रदेश वेस्टर्न एरियाज ऑफ आंध्र प्रदेश एंड नॉर्थ कर्नाटक इट इज फाउंड इन द वेस्टर्न घाट द विंदियास द सातपुरास द राजमहल हिल्स एंड पूर्वाचल रीजन ब्लैक सॉइल इज मोर ऑफ लाइम एंड मैग्नीशियम कार्बोनेट्स लैटरेट सॉइल लैक ऑफ नाइट्रोजन एंड मिनरल्स इन इंडिया दिस टाइप ऑफ सॉइल इज फाउंड इन अबाउट टू पॉइंट फोर एट लैक किलोमीटर लैटरेट सॉइल इज सी इन अबाउट इन अबाउट फाइव पॉइंट फोर सिक्स लैक किलोमीटर कॉटन जोअर व्हीट ऑनियन चिल्ली टोबैक ऑयल सीड्स लेमन एंड ग्रेप्स कॉफी एंड टी एंड अदर प्लांटेशन क्रॉप्स Draw an outline map of India and mark these: Hatti Gold Mines, Bhadravati, Kochi, Kalpakam. A. Hatti Gold Mines. B. Bhadravati. C. Kochi. D. Kalpakam. Alternative question for visually impaired candidates only. What are the aims of multi purpose river valley project providing irrigation facility production of hydroelectric power prevention of floods creating facility for water transportation providing water for domestic and industrial use preventing soil erosion developing fisheries enhancing forest wealth